Hello friends, welcome back to the One Night Study channel. Today we are going to discuss about the basics of the jet propulsion system. In this video, we will discuss about the basic concepts of the jet propulsion system. And in the next videos, we will discuss about the different types of the jet propulsive engines like ramjet engine, pulse jet engine, turbojet engines, turbo prop engines, and at all. Okay. So first of all, let's discuss about that. What is the meaning of the jet propulsion? Okay. So basic meaning of the jet propulsion is that that suppose this is an object. Okay. So the propulsion of the object in one direction it is done by the ejecting a fluid okay ejecting a fluid in the opposing direction okay so this is the concept of the jet propulsion or we can say that this is the meaning of the jet propulsion okay now the principle of the jet propulsion system is based on newton's third law of motion okay it means that the principle of the propulsion is was given by the sir isaac newton okay so what was that newton theorized that a rewarded directed acceleration could propel a machine forward at a great speed as i have told the meaning of the jet propulsion is that when a thrust or a re-awarded direction acceleration suppose this is our object and if we produce a thrust in this backward direction then definitely the object will move in the forward direction okay so basically it was the theory of the newton's third law of the motion okay a force is required to accelerate the fluid and same time there is an equal and opposite reaction force comes which is known as thrust okay so this is very important because to move a object in the forward direction we required a thrust okay thrust is very important to move any object in the forward direction okay and this forward thrust comes one of the two sources okay first source is the rotating propeller by any engine and the second one is pure z engine okay which can produce thrust so now we will discuss that how a aeroplane or we can say that how a aircraft fly okay so suppose this is our aeroplane these these are wings okay okay so if this is our direction of the weight and this is our lift okay and uh, this is our drag and this is thrust okay so to fly an aeroplane or aircraft and okay it is necessary that thrust must be equal to the drag and lift must be equal to the weight okay okay now we have understood about the basic concept of the jet propulsion system and uh, what are the importance of the thrust now it is very important to understand that how we can produce thrust and how many types of the engines by which we can produce thrust okay so jet propulsion engine may be classified as into two categories okay 
एयर ब्रीथिंग इंजन एंड द सेकेंड वन इज द रॉकेट इंजन ओके सो इन द एयर ब्रीथिंग इंजन द फ्यूल इज बर्न बाई यूज ऑफ द एटमोस्फेरिक एयर ओके रिमेंबर दिस ओके एंड इन द रॉकेट इंजन द फ्यूल इज बर्न बाई द फ्यूल ऑक्सीडेंट मिक्सचर विच इज कॉल्ड एज प्रोपेलेंट ओके ओके एंड नाउ द एयर ब्रेथिंग इंजन ओके दिस इज अवर एयर ब्रेथिंग इंजन इट इज फर्दर क्लासिफाइड इन टू टू कैटेगरीज रेसी प्रोकेटिंग और प्रोपेलर इंजन एंड द गैस टर्बाइन इंजन द फर्स्ट वन वन इज सॉरी माई मार्कर इज नॉट वर्किंग प्रॉपरली द फर्स्ट वन इज रेसिप्रोकेटिंग और प्रोपेलर इंजन रेसिप्रोकेटिंग और प्रोपेलर इंजन ओके एंड द सेकेंड वन इज गैस टर्बाइन इंजन so in the next videos basically we are going to discuss about the gas turbine engines okay now the gas turbine engines are classified into mainly the flowing categories and the most important um, engines which we are going to discuss about the first one is ramjet engine ramjet engine the second one is turbojet engine and the third one is pulse jet engine okay and the fourth one is turbo prop engine turbo fan engine okay so these are some important types of the gas turbine engines and now in the next videos we will discuss one by one each and every type of the engine okay and in the next videos we or in the next slides we are going to discuss about the basic analysis and the performance parameters of this type of the engines friends moving further let's discuss on this uh, all type of the engine and uh, the importance of writing these engines in the flowing orders okay first of all let me correction okay this is our pulse jet engine and the third one is turbojet engine okay so friend uh, this is an order to writing the engines and what is the importance by writing this order of the engine that by getting down like this okay so the mass flow rate increases okay mass flow rate increases okay and the jet velocity decreases remember this thing okay this is very important so <coughs> it will be seen that ramjet engine can be used for highest cruising speed whereas the turbo prop and the turbo prop engine will be useful for the lower crossing speed at low altitudes okay in practice the choice of the power plant will depend on the required cruising speed desired range 
of the aircraft and the maximum rate of climb okay so now the detail of the various gas turbine engines this these are the gas turbine engines okay mentioned above are discussed under two categories okay so basically there are two categories by which the gas turbine engines are discussed okay so the first one is the pilotless operation and the second is piloted operation so the ramjet and the pulse jet these two category are come under the pilotless operation okay these two categories comes under pilotless operation and the turboprop and the turbojet engines are used for the piloted operations okay so that's why i was saying that it is very important to writing in this order of the engines okay because it has some facts okay friends so here in this video we have discussed all the types of the gas turbine engines or the basic important type of the jet propulsion engines and uh, we have discussed the basic concept and the meaning of the jet propulsion system okay and in the next videos we are, we will discuss about the ramjet engines and the other type of the engines so friends if you still have not subscribed our channel then please subscribe our channel and uh, if you are liking our videos then share with it your friends thank you friends